back to helping their son. Only on 7, a local family says two pit bulls tore up their dog, and when their teenage daughter tried to save it, they got her too. KOAT Action 7 News reporter Laura Terrain spoke exclusively to that 17-year-old and a neighbor who's so scared now, she's now carrying protection. Benzie's injuries are hard to look at. A backside that's been stitched back together and more sutures around his neck. I was terrified. Jennifer Alcala says two pit bulls ripped apart her dog right in the family's backyard. You can actually you can see some of the paw prints right here. While trying to save Benzie, the 17-year-old ended up getting bitten in the arm. Despite her own pain, she feels worse for her pet. I kind of wish I was the one who should have been attacked in my dog. Because he didn't deserve it. Neighbor Serena Alameda watched the attack from her garden. It scared her so much she's now carrying around an ice scraper to defend herself just in case. Alameda says she's angry that it took more than a day for the dogs to be seized from her neighbor's home. Wednesday morning, 9:40, the bite occurred. They were given until 5:30 Thursday to surrender those dogs. Police acknowledge there was a delay. They tell us it took time to track down the dogs' owners. Plus, Rio Rancho law states potentially dangerous animals. Can only be taken with a court order or if they're surrendered. We're told the owners did eventually hand over both dogs to authorities, and police say the owner is being charged with several crimes. Laura Terrain, KOAT, Action 7 News. Those charges against the owner include animal cruelty and having potentially dangerous and vicious dogs. Police say the two pit bulls that attacked Benzie will be euthanized. We're learning more about.